Welcome, I'm Hawaiian Shirt Papa. Sometimes with others, I visit a variety of antique, vintage, and thrift shops within Southern Ontario. Sometimes we don't get anything. Come tour with me vicariously. Hi, and welcome to another tour by Hawaiian Shirt Papa, this time in Harrow, Ontario, at the Full Circle Thrift Shop. Beautiful little shop, nicely laid out. They have grouped things in a rational, sensible manner. Uh, I mean, really, uh, Glassware and stemware like displayed so the light shines through is probably one of the best ways of displaying it and using the natural light of the uh, from the windows of the shop. There are some areas a little dimmer, but that they're vastly over num overnumbered by all the well lit areas of the rest of the store. I, that was not a complaint or or a suggestion to change anything. It's just the nature of some so, some types of shelving and sh they, they are just a hint dimmer. Um, some of these areas uh, I have some stills that uh, they, it show great examples of what they've done, like the blue section here. This is in the showcase windows. You can actually look at it from outside as well. The red is just over there. And I think I've got the still for that right here. As again, you can see it from outside as well. But the sunlight just shining through it just exemplifies the, the beauty of the items in question. Even the clear stuff starts to show the reason it's has gone through its cycles of being desirable. Uh, Westwood Avenue has a great, great affinity for the clear glass, and she's well stocked in that. If somebody's ever looking for a particular type, she could probably tell you if she, tell you if she does have some of it. It's a lovely amber colored uh, glassware there. There's showcases with the jewelry. I I'm not sure if it's costume or if it's got something more, but they are nicely, nicely displayed. And they do have some furniture. They also use it to help display some of their beautiful items. The back of the store has more utilitarian items and they're in little niches. But then you have these other lovely displays. This is one on a table where they've taken a collection of blue ceramics and glass for a setting. <coughs> the book section is is very neat they've provided a chair for those who wish to to have a closer examination of their select possible selections as i said the more utilitarian materials are at the back and here's some of the other settings they've put the artwork in relation to the specific pieces of furniture there they have out on display this uh, <clears throat> interesting bowl as you saw in that label was handcrafted in on the on Vancouver Island so they know its provenance to some degree that's right 
by that yellow vase. You saw it briefly. That's why I have still photos. This is in the front window on the on the main street, uh, beside the entrance. As I as I say, really lovely layout. The street's been redone in the last few years, so the sidewalk has been upgraded to a more interesting one. Again, another set of tables. Nicely laid out. Small appliances, as is mo as they as most thrift stores have them, along with serving pieces and kitchen utensils. Small frames and so forth. Some suitcases and such. The, the back room was entered there. Like I said, the back area is more utilitarian. The front is really gorgeously laid out. Interesting case. That was an uh, art artist's case because it had, and it was labeled as such because the inside has some uh, bits of paint on it. Magazines, the furniture is labeled. There's even a small fridge. wicker basket uh, suitcase this is the table I've actually turned it so you can see more of it this one's done in whites with some accent colors this is from the outside looking in a set of uh, candle of uh, candle holders small bottle And this is a view of the white glass. I think it's maybe Fenton, but I'm not going to commit to that. At Westwood would know more about that. She's also a little more into the oh, oil lamps. This is another example of one of the views from outside looking in. This is a, of some necklaces that are on display. Uh, what more can you ask for? I mean, they've repurposed another building and given us a, a lovely thrift store with artistic merit. Now, the only thing is, it's cash only. Sorry to surprise you and throw that in right at the end, but it is important for you to be aware of that. There is no ATM in the store either. So I hope you have enjoyed this tour. I hope you're going to subscribe and give us a like and possibly even give us a, a mark on the bell so you'll be notified of any future videos hope you're doing well and we'll see you at the next video thanks